Hello, welcome to Malta and to our beautiful capital city of uh, Valletta. My name is Fiona. We are standing right here next to the Triton Fountain, which has been recently restored for the inauguration of Valletta 2018. In 2018, Valletta was the European cultural capital city. I'm going to show you my five top spots in Valletta. Come on, let's go. We are in front of the new city gate, uh, which along uh, with the new Maltese Parliament and the transformation of the Opera House uh, was uh, recently redesigned uh, by the Italian architect Renzo Piano. And here is the man who started it all, uh, Jean Parizot de la Vallette, uh, who was the founder of the city itself uh, and after whom the city was named. Uh, he laid uh, the first foundation stone uh, just across the road uh, in the chapel of Our Lady of Victories over 450 years ago. And here we are in Straight Street. Since the Knights period until the mid-60s, it was the red light district of Valletta with a naughty reputation. In the recent years, uh, it is once again the beating heart of the city and it is the perfect spot uh, for a dinner or for a drink. And this is the jewel of our city, Valletta, a must-see monument, uh, the St. John's Co-Cathedral. There is a contrast between the exterior and the interior part of the cathedral. The facade was built in a very plain and simple manner, whereas the interior part was highly richly decorated in the Baroque uh, style. In the oratory of the cathedral itself, uh, there are the two masterpieces of the famous Italian painter Caravaggio. We are standing uh, here in front uh, of the uh, impressive palace Auberge de Castile, the Auberge of the Spanish and Portuguese Knights. Nowadays it houses the office of the Maltese Prime Minister. The building is situated on one of the highest points in Valletta, with fantastic views all over the island. And now we are in the upper Baraka Gardens. Along with the lower Baraka Gardens, they offer breathtaking views of the Grand Harbor and the three cities which are situated across Valletta. The Grand Harbor is the largest natural harbor in the Mediterranean. If you happen to be here at noon, don't be surprised to hear a big boom. And uh, this is the perfect spot uh, for a nice cold uh, Chisk beer, Malta's favorite beer. There's much more to see in Valletta, so I hope that you will visit us soon. Thanks for watching uh, and watch out for our next uh, video. Saha!